Buckle up, because this is gonna mess with your head. We are diving into the idea that we are not actually die, but just keep hopping from body to body after we kick the bucket. Think reincarnation is crazy? Here is a mind bender. You are already changing bodies throughout your life. Look at childhood photos. That little person staring back is practically a stranger compared to you now, right? The same goes for your family and friends. Years of growth transforms us into what appear to be entirely different people. It makes you wonder, could this be a tiny taste of a much bigger cycle? We are so used to it that we don't even notice. Already in this life we transition from the body of a child to the body of a young man, an adult, and then an old man, and after death we get a new one. Our body is like clothes. Just as we throw away old, worn-out items and buy new ones instead, so it is with our body. As soon as it is no longer able to fulfill its functions, we dispose of it and move on to a new one. And this will continue until we realize ourselves, God, and break the cycle of birth and death and find eternal life in the spiritual world. Our human body is a great gift, because only with its help can we learn that in fact we are an eternal soul, not our body, and only with its help can we restore our forgotten relationship with God and attain eternal life. And if we spend our whole life only trying to surround ourselves with greater comfort and bring ourselves more pleasure, we will simply waste time and we will have to be born and die again and again in our full of suffering material world. You may ask, what's the problem? I am born a human every time, and if I didn't manage to realize myself this time, I will in the next. The problem is that, before getting a human body, the soul goes through lower forms of life, such as plants, insects and animals. So, if you are now in a human body, it means that you have already lived millions of lives in these lower forms. And if you don't realize yourself and attain eternal life now, then it's unknown when you will be born a human again and have such an opportunity. Think about what I said and don't miss this very rare chance to end death once and for all. And for this, you don't need to do much. Just remember God, start and do not stop learning about Him and don't intentionally sin. That's it. And if you have any questions, I will be happy to answer them.